Hey everyone, I had my nephews over this weekend and I was trying to find an easy, cheap craft for us to do. So we headed to the Dollar Tree and we bought powdered donuts and made snowman crafts with them. First, you'll want to start with some poster board or you could even use felt. I had some leftover poster board, so I used the product that I had. So you'll want to cut out a hat for your snowman. So next we're going to take the donuts out of the original packaging and I put them in a leftover small gift bag that I have, but you can use um, Ziploc bags or any clear bag that you have. You'll want to have four donuts in there, one for the head and three for the body. Leave enough room to zip tie them or you can use an old bread twisty top. and you will cut off the excess and put your twisty tie on. I want to take a moment and thank you so much for finding our page and watching our videos. We hope you find value in it and some helpful hints. We do hope that you continue to watch and subscribe. So now you have your two bodies and you'll want to glue on the hats and then you can use dollar store twine or if you have any leftover ribbon from the house and then you'll tie your scarf. And I actually just used a Sharpie because I have younger nephews, but you can get as creative with this as you would like. You can use sequins. You could even use very small buttons but I just went ahead and decorated with Sharpies. So you have to make sure that you have a carrot. Look how much he's looking like Frosty. The boys were so excited. Look how cute he is. Now let's add our buttons. I started with blue, and as you'll see, I'll go to yellow next, but the yellow did not show up, so you can always go over that with a different Sharpie, or like I said, you could use sequins or whatever makes you happy. So as a reminder, all of these items came from the Dollar Tree. You can get your donuts there, ribbon, the bags, you can get twine, all of it came from there. So it's a very cheap and easy idea for the kids to do. These would actually be great if you have a holiday party at school. You could send these as gifts for each of their friends. Now onto the mouth. Gotta make him extra cute and make him look extra happy. Next, we're going to move on to the next one. I decided to make this one a little different. My nephew wanted to use ribbon on his. So we cut the ribbon and then make sure and cut off enough to where you can tie it into a knot. As you see, it can be a little hard to manipulate. As you can see, my mom is walking by. She's helping my nephew with theirs, so don't think they're not doing the craft with me. So now we're going to work on his cute little face. So you'll take your Sharpie and you'll decorate his eyes, his nose, and his little buttons.
Look how super cute they are. My nephews just love this project. We hope you enjoy.